Welcome back to Photoshop. Have a great day to all. I hope you all watch Photoshop video section 1 and 2. If not, kindly watch fully. I have the link of section 1 and 2 in this video description also. Today, we are going to see the chapter 2 common editing skills. From this title itself, it is very clear. We should have some editing skills commonly to edit the Photoshop. We'll see the things uh, editing image. We having four. First one cropping the image, resizing an image and correcting, sharpening or blurring an image. Today we'll see only the two things and reminding this correcting and sharpening. We'll see on next section. So cropping an image. See here in the toolbox, this is the crop tool. This allow you to select an area of image and discard everything outside the selected area. Okay, this tool you can find in the toolbox. Yes. So after cropping the image look like this only. Fine. So next is the marquee tool. See here in the toolbox, see here is the marquee tool. This marquee tool or selected selection tools and this is also used to crop an image. The types of marquee tool are for rectangular marquee tool, elliptical marquee tool, single row marquee tool and single column marquee tool. So see here the difference. Image cropped with rectangular marquee tool look like this and image cropped with the elliptical marquee tool look like this. So now just we are seeing the theory part. I will explain in the demo clearly. So next comes very very important thing is the pixels. The word pixel is the short form of picture element. Okay. So in digital image everything is made up of huge number of individual dots called pixels. See here, see every digital image is a very tiny rectangular which can be measured in terms of pixels. If you see the picture you can identify it. See here, small small uh, dots like that is a no, that's a pixels. We can call it as pixels. A digital camera are often referred to in terms of the megapixel capability uh, this means how many million pixels are in your photo so for a photo or an image the pixel is very very important next thing this is the second thing the resizing an image this is also important thing once you want to create it uh, that is a, um, what is it greeting card so this is also a very important concept resizing an image so to resize an image first go to the image menu and move on to the image size okay so after that the image dialog box will appear like this so here you need to change the height and width see here width and height you can change and document size height and width also you can change so original image will look like this after that after the process resized image will look like this okay fine see now we'll move on to the demo section just i'll close this i'll open photoshop i already installed so photoshop cs6 yes i'll open So, yes, open this, yes, it will take some time, just wait, yes, it's loading, yeah, fine. Now, we'll move on to the demo part. First thing is cropping an image, you all know. 
This crop tool allow you to select an image and discard everything outside the selected area. So before cropping an image, it should be loaded. So in this in, uh, example, we are going to load and one flower image. So first click on file menu and open. Okay. And then choose the picture file and where you load it right where that's here is open so the image will be loaded into your document right so click on the crop tool here just in the toolbox this is the toolbox you all know this is the crop tool just you click on the crop tool now click and drag on the area where you want to crop. See here, just this area alone I need. It's fine. Okay. You can use the rectangular point on the corners of the pixel. See here to extend the crop. Or you can use shortcut key escape to cancel the crop action. That's fine. So press the enter key, you want to press the enter key in the keyboard to complete the crop action. The image is cropped now. Is it clear? It's very simple. Yes. So first thing is over with the crop tool. Fine. We'll move on to the marquee tool. So uh, second one is marquee tool, right? This marquee tool also this is a selection tool which allow you to do selection in form of rectangular or any um, ellipse shapes or, or a single row or column. Okay. The marquee tool are also used to crop an image. We can use the crop tool or the marquee tool. That's your wish. You all know this marquee tool have four types. There's a rectangular, elliptical, single row and then single column. Okay. Fine. Now what I'm going to do is. To crop an image using this marquee tool, click the first, you want to click the marquee tool of your choice and requirement. Fine. In this example, the elliptical marquee tool is used. So just I'll click this. Select the area. See here, just I am going to use select this one, first one. And select the area you want to crop in the image. Just I want to crop this alone means again, just I'll crop this. Yes. After selection, you can see the selection area with a marking over the selection. Yes. Right? Click the image and you can go for the crop. Yes. Now it got crop. If you want to deselect the crop, just right click. Okay. And you can do that also deselect also you can do okay fine yes so yes you can select this and crop and press enter so this alone will be selected now fine the same way if you want to select this one see here i'll give escape I'll open new image. See this alone selected. Just I'm going to open another one thing. Crop it. Yes. Now only the crop action is over. Now just I select this oval. See by this way you can do it. Oval selection and you crop it and press enter. So now thing is selected and you can crop it. See, even more, it's there. So, next thing is the resize an image. It's a very important concept. So, for this, I'll select another uh, one. I'll open image. Um, yes, I'll select another one image. Open is yes, fine. First step we want to do is load an image. Okay, what you want, you can load and go to the select that's image menu is a menu bar right 
in that go to image and you want to select the image size yes so here this is the dialog box right you can see the image size dialog this is the image size dialog box and next step what you want to do is you can change the width and height okay in the properties to resize the image so here what i can do is now i'll change it as uh, like 525 and height i need uh, like 350 and here in the document size i need 20.55 that's your wish how you are going to prepare the greeting card that's your wish so one um is first i said right fine see here i 525 and 5 as 350 so here i'll change it as 18 and here i'll change it as 12 25 so you can see here the difference whatever we are changing here the pixels we can change pixels or percent here centimeter see here centimeter or points whatever you want you can change it here also so whatever here you are changing like 500 if you are giving if you give means it will change see now you can see they right yes so the same way you can do it go to image image size and here like if i give 300 see here so now you can see that the size of the image is resized without affecting its resolution or clarity the clarity is very very important to edit the images is fine the demo section is over just i'll close this photoshop yes now we we'll having few questions in the see i hope the concept is very clear today just few questions to test your knowledge in this chapter try to answer in the photoshop window the crop tool is in the dash the first one just try to answer and second to complete the crop action use dash key I informed you so try to answer this and third one to crop an image click on dash menu yes okay fine uh, we come to end of this section we will meet on next section thank you be happy and make others happy be safe take care bye bye